Well, hello everyone. What is going on? It's the Almighty Jeff, and I'm here with episode three. Yep, of Search Row Two. I had a moment there. Um, in the previous episode, we collected some CDs and tags, and we found a secret area up in Misty Lane. We then completed the Hoenda version, and then we did the factory's insurance fraud, which granted us unlimited sprint, which comes under abilities, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, I re-downloaded my DLC because they didn't appear last time, so everything's all back and nice. Anyway, we are up in Misty Lane again, and we are just about to start the next mission, which is Down Payment, I believe it's called. Yep, so I'll be quiet and let you watch the cutscene. Yeah, that'd be great. Johnny, who's that? Yo, come to the living room and find out. Johnny, I don't care if you just broke out of jail. You do not mess with my furniture. Oh my God, it's you. Surprise, Aisha. What, that you're here or that you're talking? Pick one. We all thought you were dead. I almost was. Well, for someone who was blown to hell, you look great. <laughs> Did you do something with your hair? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Yo, can we get back to business? What's the rush? I've been cooped up on death row and that bitch has been laid out in a coma. Hmm. We definitely need to remind motherfuckers who we are. And that can't wait until after dinner? No. no. <laughs> you two haven't changed at all. Well, you know, there's a saying about dogs and blowing shit up. <laughs> so what's the plan? We get our crew together. Once we got that, we can work on how we're taking back our city. Sounds good. And where were you planning on having this little meeting? No. Well, this place is pretty spacious. No. The color's very soothing. No. Come on, Ish. This ain't no fucking gang clubhouse. Change of plans. We gotta find a new place. Yeah, you got it. Okay. Right, what have you done with my phoenix? I literally spent time finding that. Oh, wow. Damn it. Head over to the old mission house. We should be able to set up shop there. Why don't we just set up shop at the church? Altoy's renovated it and turned it into a tourist trap. You're kidding me. I wish I was. We gotta find a new place and the mission house will be perfect. Religious buildings are kind of been there, done that. And we're not staying in the mission. Now check it out. Years ago, an earthquake dropped part of the city below sea level, and rather than clearing out the rubble, the city just built over it. There's an abandoned hotel below the mission that'll work for us. All right, what's the catch? We got to evict the current tenants. Sounds like fun. <laughs> This is what we're going to be doing today. Um, we're going to be completing the down payment mission, which is not that difficult a mission. Um, there's, a bit, there's a shootout involved, but it's nothing too extreme. Um, we'll be um, spraying some tags that's around the local area, and we'll be doing two activities. We'll be doing the es uh, doing an escort activity, which will grant us free vehicle delivery, and the Brighton Snatch, which will give us unlimited SMG ammo. So we've got a lot to do today, guys. Um, it'll probably be not as long as I expected once we once I cut out a lot of it, but but for me it's a lot of work. So okay, let's make our way underground. for ourselves if you don't mind. So these are the sons of Sandy. This is actually the first gang we're going to be taking out. I think it's actually my favourite gang, I'd say. I don't know why. I 
just love them. Yeah, they do. Um, not Gary. Yeah, so you want to go into this side. This is the side that's filled with these. Um, I'm just trying to pick as many guns as we can because this will save them to our uh, to our weapon stash, meaning that we won't have to buy them later. The ammunition. Because it's actually quite a lot of money to spend on guns in this game. These guys are hiding in the bosses. Run, fight me. Hurt you. You're an idiot. Okay, so we need to go to the other side now. Evict the other tenants, which are the homeless people. Oh, to do this, we need to get human shields. And throw them in. This is like a bit of irony. It's quite funny. Um. there for because he literally is a killing machine. But there we go, that ends that mission. So, what you think? It's kind of a shithole. <laughs> See that? But it's a shithole with potential. I don't know, mate. Oh, come on, a stripper pole, some flat screens, maybe some nicer furniture. You have me stripper pole. Fucking A. And there we go. Again, homeless bums, no more homeless. How unfortunate. And a thousand dollars, which is decent. We got our first neighborhood at Old Stillwater. Which, you know, we can make tons of profit from that. And we got our second hideout. Well, our second crib, which is the Saints hideout. So this is where we're going to be spending the majority of our time. And there we go. That's that mission done with. Very nice indeed. Alright, so we are going to head straight back down. We're not starting that mission yet. We won't do it for a while yet. We're going to head back down because as you may have, if you've been paying attention, you would have seen that there were two tags down there. So we're going to get both of them. The first one we're going to get is just in here and up these wooden stairs. And we're not going to get any um, notes right for this, guys, because if you have control of a HUD and the tag is in the area that you control, then if this, if, well, basically, 
if the Saints control territory and the tag is in that territory, you won't get any notoriety. But if it's owned by anyone, whether it's a gang or Ultor, then you'll get notoriety for it. And here's the second one. And these are the only two collectibles in Old Stillwater. Now, we are going to get another two tags, which are just outside. Uh, what's the exit? So, there are two tags up on the upper ground that's actually just around the corner, so we'll get those two whilst we're here as well. So, the first one is just down here and on this wall. But this territory is still owned by the Ronin, so we will. Oh, sorry, Sons of Sandy. So they'll get, as you can see, the green the green bar that shows that they're after us. But in, not, we won't actually probably get to a, a full level, so we don't really need to worry about it that much. Pretty simples. So that's that done. Pretty easy. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to this activity right down the road. As I said earlier, this is the escort activity. Front us. Oh, bloody hell, there's some. <laughs> Oh, there's someone stuck in our hood. That's always you really fun. Think you could take but yeah, this will grant us free. It will if we finish all six levels. It will grant us free. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> um, free vehicle deliveries, which we're gonna need for something that we're going to do immediately after the next activity. So the first thing we'll do um, in the next episode. Right, honestly, what the hell is going on? <laughs> okay, so let's start this activity. Hello, mon ami. What can Sykes do for you? You know what the overhead for running a gang is? I've got to get some money rolling in. Charity is not a favorite virtue of Sykes. Perhaps, though, Sykes can interest you in some work. Keep talking. Naturally, as Sykes is currently under investigation by the Stillwater PD, this is, of course, hypothetical. But if there was a car out front containing a loose woman, and if you were to provide an environment where said woman could entertain lustful individuals, or while maintaining their privacy, Sykes might be able to pay you in cash or in trade. Cash is good. Looks like we have ourselves a partnership, no? Partnership nothing, I'm just driving around your whores. As you do. Alright, so just like um, last time with the insurance fraud, I'm going to show you just the first level. So... It doesn't get too boring. Can you sign this release form? Actually, I'll show you the first level and the last level. I think that um, is quite a good schedule to follow, to be honest. What? This wasn't part of the plan. I mean, unlike the insurance fraud, I could just show you good hits. This one, it's just you can't really do that. So I'll just show you the first and last levels. I need to write that down. So this first level is pretty easy compared to what it'll be like because you're just going to kind of keep away from the paparazzi and drive, basically. So the pleasure bar goes up, but later on you'll actually have to start doing, like, abiding to people's requests. There we go. Pretty easy. We'll just drop them off. Don't forget to buy my book when it comes out! Do I still have any lipstick on me? There we go. Level 1 complete. Pretty easy. So on 8 bars of respect. So I'll see you guys at level 6. Alright guys, here we are. Level 6 of Escort. 
I'm sure this will go, but it took me three attempts to do level five, so. But everyone just kept wanting to go to the marina. And that was like on the other side of the map. When was the last time you brushed your teeth? I'm also good about the marina, I don't understand. Oh well. Hurry up. I'm not going to hold it. Step on the gas! It's a pretty no, easy one. This <coughs> just <coughs> oh, look what you did! Not today, fascist scum! Just don't tell me to take you anywhere. Just keep your head down, baby, be good. If we both come up with this. <laughs> if you do, I might just cry. Our girl is as white as a ghost. No! No, no! Get the hell out of here! <laughs> Next time I'll bring my scum. That looks like my it. boyfriend's car. Don't even think about sticking that there. Stupido, One less witness like this ain't set in the right mood. God damn it, I need that film. Don't you have any respect for people? Wow. What the hell do you have in there? Fast, 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 fast. I didn't see nothing. Dry. Hey! You wanna do your damn job? You gotta okay this shit with the club. <sighs> Fine, just get it over with. USA! Oh, come on, USA! Really USA! Really USA! 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 So with everybody? I think we're done. I think we're done. That looks like my boyfriend's car. Oh, uh, yes. Beautiful. Are you crying? Prepare yourself. I'm going deep! Wow, that was the greatest I've ever had. I may not have enough money to pay the rent now, but it was worth it. Hurry it up, come on. Thank you. <clears throat> and there we go, level 6 escort complete. 5k. And... 14 bars of respect. Nice, nice. And we can now call vehicles for free. Just like I said. I'm lying to you, see. I know what you thought. You thought he's lying. Yep. Alright. So, as you can see, we get unlockable rewards. Vehicles. No. Homies, that's what it is. Vehicle delivery. Very nice. I need a car. But now, I can just call for one. I've been waiting to show you what I can do. There we go. Very nice. We used to steal his lunch money back in junior high. But whatever it is, it doesn't really matter because we're going to need a four-doored vehicle for this next activity, which is just down hither. This is the Brighton. It is Brighton, isn't it? Not making it up. Yeah. But that activity is good for discovering locations like stores and activities and stuff. You can get quite a lot to pop up from that activity. This, this is quite a difficult activity, guys, Snatch, just because of the fact that the people here need to save the holes. They are... Oh my God. Special is underestimating the word when it comes to the fact that we'll just stand there and take the time. Why is there a policeman after me? What have I done wrong? I was just crashed into a lamppost, that's it. I was just, you know, piss off. Oh my god, what is all these cars stopping in my way? Come on, out of the way, bitches. <sighs> but yeah, this mission is, pr this activity pretty much is a pain in the ass, but we're gonna get it done anyway, and the reward is worth it. So, start up a snatch. I'm surprised you're not still working from the trailer, Helmers. 
Well, you know, I figured I needed to keep a closer eye on my girls. How's that working out for you? I got no idea where the hell they are. You think that might have something to do with you parking your ass in a lawn chair and making beer pyramids instead of working the corner? What are you getting at? Just that maybe you... You getting smart with me? No, I'm just... Because if I think you getting smart with me, I got a good mind to step out of this chair and give you a tanning. All I'm trying to say is you're a busy guy who can't be bothered to keep tabs on everyone. Why not go track down your missing girls? You'd do that for me. If you got the money, sure. Yep. That's pretty much what we're doing. Bring Hog back safely from their abusive pimps to earn cash and respect. So this is actually a decent vehicle. I mean, it's slow. Ish, the Churchill. But it's got a decent amount of armour on it. And it has four doors. So it means you can bring the most pause back immediately. But as per usual, we're going to... I'm going to show you level one. Level six. Uh, I said about him being pretty special. There's a door right there. Come on. He wants to get away with not really interacting with the enemy gang much there. But when it gets later on, they'll literally be all over you. And you'll just be getting mad. And sometimes they come back and kidnap one of your. Oh, so if you've already taken back and then you've got to, you don't have an option of just taking someone else. You've got to go back and save them. That's level one, so I'll see you guys at level six. Oh my god, that was freaking... Second attempt at level six, part two, if you didn't already guess, but... I was so close. I was literally just at where the last two those were at. Five minutes left, still looking really good, and I got freaking massacred. Um, you know when all your, <laughs> your freaking weapon runs out of ammo, and it's still like about four running and three pimps all shooting at you. It ain't good, son. He just said in the last part, I was like, right, okay. I've managed to get by with none of my holes being taken. Like, I don't know how you can get the holes being taken. But obviously. Get out. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Why can't you shoot me up as well? You're literally the, the scourge of humanity. the time. Fucking move, everybody! Oh great, now he's getting away. Thanks, thanks everybody. Thanks for your fucking input. Oh shit, he's crashed, he's crashed, he's crashed. He's crashed. He's crushed. He's crushed. And he's away again. And he's away again. Oh no. Jesus H. Christ. Are you taking the piss? Are you literally... I give up. I give up. Freaking... There is no way that just freaking happened. If 
that guy didn't capture it, I'd reckon I'd be on my way back by now with the second set of three. Limousines are slow and hard to manoeuvre. Oh, we've just experienced a light. Yep, there we go. We'll get close to you. Really, really. Get in, get in, get in. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't understand what makes them decide on which side they're going to get into, but honestly, it is something beyond my imagination. So I park up very conveniently right next to him and he goes to the other side of the car. Like, what even is all that about? You were trying to save me, not get you do this. I do not want you to do this. But it doesn't matter because I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna say anything because I'm just gonna jinx myself. Probably like just like a surprise explosion. Boom, there we go. Level six. Done. Molto bene. 5k, very nice. 20 bars of respect. And unlimited SMG ammo. Very nice indeed. And there we go. So we've done two activities this time, so we've done quite a bit. Now we are going to just quickly return to the hideout and we're going to equip our new SMG with unlimited ammo. Yeah, that was, um, by the way, should probably show you. you. We actually unlock a weapon from completing level 3, which is the GAL 43. So, we'll have a new, gu new gun and unlimited ammo for it, which is pretty cool. And um, I prefer to use SMGs anyway. So, that's really the only one I care about, to be honest. Oh, oh, okay. No, no crap, I didn't mean to. <laughs> I just saw a triangle when I thought, it was, I thought someone was calling me or something. Which wouldn't make sense, because we don't even own any gang territories yet. <laughs> I'm an idiot, basically. Okay, so here we are. We are back at the crib. So let's check it out what we've gained today. I think originally in my first playthrough, I stopped after the escort and did the snatch. It's it later. We've got 500 bucks in the. In the bank, we've got the dual wield NR4, dual wield Gal 43 with infinite ammo, very nice. And there we go. You do actually need to equip the gun, um, the ammo, out your crib, otherwise it just won't appear. But there we freaking go. Um, I think off screen, what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna find a Venom Classic and potentially a Kenshin as well. Just because it be it's going to help the first things that we're going to do in the next episode. But first off, let's save our game. And we're at 
that's a big increase much bigger than I thought to be honest so that's five percent yeah five percent increase that's really good we're one twentieth more towards our goal which is that's pretty cool actually not gonna lie anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did be sure to like comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next episode